How to Love a Transracially Adopted Person, Part 7. I am closing out this series with some reflections on the six installments I've made up to now. And I centered on three words. The first is excruciating. How excruciating it has been and continues to be to not have connections to my family of origin, particularly my mother of origin. Um, not to have her, her love, her, her touch, her, uh, gaze, her connection to genetics in my daily life. Same is true for my biological father. Also excruciating when you think of love to think that I might date my biological brother. Pretty excruciating. 